So a few years ago, I tried to draw a picture because I love drawing pictures. I tried to draw a picture of the world that we want to live in. And it, silly though it sounds, it came out looking like a donut, an American one with a hole in the middle. So imagine a donut, there's the outside and then there's the inside and there's that hole in the middle. In the hole in the middle, that's a space of deprivation, a space of shortfall where people don't have the resources to meet the essentials of life. Like they don't have enough food or education. They don't have access to electricity, enough income. They don't have decent housing. So it's a space of shortfall and we want to get people out of that hole in the middle into the donut. But we want to do that for the whole world, making sure that we also don't go beyond the donut's outer crust because that's a space of ecological overshoot where humanity puts more pressure on the planet than the planet can take and we start causing climate change or massive loss of biodiversity. We start creating a hole in the ozone layer or polluting Earth with chemicals that we add to it. So we need to both get people out of deprivation and poverty, but also protect Earth and protect these fundamental life-supporting systems that keep us alive. Those are the two sides of human well-being, the inside and the outside of the donut. And the 21st century challenge is a unique one. It's to get everybody out of poverty while coming back in at the same time. That's never been taken on before. And that's partly why we need to rewrite economics, because it's a completely new way of looking at what human well-being is.